Hello, it's Tuesday. I'm going to have to sit down. I'm stood up. Just give me a second. And I'm going to cough. <coughs> I've had a really bad cold. Um, right, I'm back on these. I don't know if you're sick of seeing these. I'm not sick of working on them. I'm absolutely loving it. But I just took... So I've got... I had eight. And if you follow my blog, you'll know that I've been doing patchwork for the edges. If you don't follow my blog, I intend to edge all of these with double two inch patchwork edges um, so I've got a lot of patchwork to do um, but in the meantime in the meantime so that's how far I've got I haven't even got enough patchwork for one of them yet and it, if you do patchwork you'll know it's time consuming um, so just as a break from patchwork it actually quite hurts your fingers as well stitching through paper and fabric it's surprising so I've got eight okay um, quick run through them let me just move that there so that's one two the theme the constant through all these is the grandmother's flower garden motif so that's two three four five six and you might notice that the different sizes, but they're all marked at seven inches, okay? Some have just got bigger hemming allowance than others, no particular reason. Um, six, seven. Now, I'm not sure that one's finished yet. I might want to put some scattered things on there. And eight. But as a break from stitching patchwork squares, I started another one. It's here. So it's got marked seven inch extremities of the stitched area and then I'll give it a little frame of web stitches there I've given it a frame of web stitches okay there and there grandmother's flower garden and here that's a little half pocket half circle pocket but it's supposed to be a flower coming in off the side so what I've done I've got five little circular petals which are little appliques and I've edged them with um, chain stitch now that one isn't edged I was going to edge that one on camera and just to say so if you compare the edged ones with the one that isn't edged I can see the difference there's a massive difference in the appearance of those I always edge my applique. I don't know if you do. I don't know if you're supposed to. I don't know if the rule book says I'm going to back of the year dot about applique. If you applique anything, you've got to edge it. I don't know. But I just know that personal choice with me is I have to edge it because it defines it. And I think that's really well illustrated there. I think that shows us really well how it defines it. So this one, as well as the other one that I said I might do a scattering, I don't know what else I'm going to put on here yet. Um... Sometimes I know straight away, others times I just have to go with it and see what comes to me when I'm working on it. So they really are small these, I don't know what they measure. Um, less than an inch I would say across. So they don't take long to stitch around. And it really is worth the time. Um, just little chain stitches. Just finishes it off nicely. Now I have occasionally as well double edge something so for example oh, I've chain stitched round or running stitched round and then I've also gone round with bullion knots as well that can be nice I'm just not sure I've got enough room here to do that around each circle um, you see what I'm doing yeah. So there we are, little chain stitch. I say it doesn't take long, if I wasn't on camera, I'd have done it by now, for some reason. If somebody's watching me, it takes me longer. But other times it's just automatic, just and quicker than this. Got this cold, I got it off my little grandson. He's two, he's a super spreader. It's like Typhoid Mary. <coughs> I'm gonna 
honestly. Anyway. Right, just one more. And then we're done. Okay, take it to the back. And fasten it off. <coughs> Excuse me. So now I just have to decide what else is going on here, but I'm not in a rush because I'm going to do some more patchwork today. It's pat back to patchwork today. Um, but that's how that square is looking. So I need to definitely need something, but not something up here just plonked on there. I'd like something that kind of integrates it, that draws it all together. And what that is, I've got no idea. <coughs> but I will think about that while I'm doing more of this. Um, yeah, okay, just a little bit of chain stitch for you today. <laughs> 